do you want to talk about now? Um, you wanna know what? I think we should talk about rumors of the Xbox 720 on what a game is tag video. Um, do you think it's true? Yeah. Do you think? Yeah. So, guys, if you missed that, there we were talking about. Well, if you, talk, if you missed it, basically, we want to talk about the Xbox 720. If you haven't uh, seen Woody's video, well, I'll put a link in the description so you can go and check it out. Basically, Woody Gamertag the other day was talking about Woody, Woody Gamertag. Woody's Gamertag was talking about the other day the Xbox 720 and some uh, some news from it. And I was just to ask Ross if it was true. So, do you reckon? Do you reckon it will get? Pretty decent. Do you reckon the Xbox 720 will be have similar features to the uh, PS uh, PS4? Uh, um, if the PS if the Xbox 720 does not have better features than the PS4, then the PS4 is an outsell them. Yeah. I mean, the fact that the rumor was on PS4 that um the game is going to be a hundred pound is complete bollocks. I don't think that will happen because let's be honest. Um. Companies aren't going to make enough money, are they? Really? Think about yeah. Well, that. here's the deal. When I say that they're going to outsell them, it's not that I. It's not that I'm being straight up like, oh, they're definitely going to outsell them because they're PS4. Oh, fanboy, fanboy. <coughs> so that sort of thing. Yeah. It's more as they're probably going to have some kind of extent of them outselling them because if people find out it's got sim, if it's like lower specs in the PS4. And people aren't going to buy the Xbox, they're going to pay uh, pay and play the PS4. Yeah. Because I'm, if if I find out the PS4 has 8 gig and the Xbox has 4 gig of RAM, then that's bullshit, isn't it? Yeah. So, in a way, there's a chance that they could outsell them to a point. But only if, specs are signi only if the specs are significantly low. Yeah. That's the only point where they're not selling. But yeah, the uh, Xbox is going to have similar specs. Yeah. Uh, hopefully it's going to have similar specs, if not better. It needs to have better specs. So yeah. So yeah, so... Yeah, I mean, same here. I mean, I can sort of... I, I do believe it in a sort of way. And I'm also about that. And I reckon that will be absolutely fantastic. I mean... I, as you, if you don't know already, guys, I used to have a PS3, and I can be honest, PS3 was a good console. I, I you know, I made use of that console, but the con, the content and all that, they don't pay for it, so you get it a lot later, and it, it's never always quite good, and the online games are a bit shocking. So it's best to probably, uh, I would think I'd definitely buy another Xbox again, no matter what it is, 720. Flipping XX, come on, Ross, get on this elevator. Or, you know, something stupid like that. But, you know, I reckon it will definitely be worth it, and I probably will definitely buy one. So, yeah, so I'm definitely looking forward to see what we can come out with on the Xbox 720 or PS4. But, yeah. Yeah. I mean, <clears throat> hey, we've got ages yet. We've got Modern Warfare 4 coming out. Hopefully, mate. Well, maybe. Not hopefully, maybe. We might have another Sledgehammer crappy game coming out. You know, Fallout 4 rumours are going to be released hopefully soon. There's all sorts of crap that's coming out, and you know, if it is going to be on the next console, then no offence to Microsoft, but they better book up their ideas quick time if these games are going to come out, and these games better be able to run on the new consoles, otherwise, there's no point. There really is no yeah. really point. And, uh, I mean, if they release another Call of Duty game. <laughs> Like a couple of months after the new consoles have dropped, but it's not on any of the new consoles, and that'll be that'll be bad, won't it? Mm, it will be, because that thing about uh, like it comes like a key gen, um, oh, I don't know key, sorry, but you have to activate and then it just stays on that console. That's bloody. That 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 can that can be good. No, that can't can be good. Do that, can they? No, that that's gonna be it, terrible. It if they do that, then they're, they're probably going to miss out. Service. I'm not sure how it works. It, it might be complete opposite. They probably miss out. They might even miss out sales in the pre-owned games. But I'm pretty sure with the pre-owned games, there's a percentage of the money that's given Microsoft for it. Probably, yeah, probably is. 
But I mean, that would just wreck businesses so bad because, and and, and think about like when you want to share some stuff with your mates, you know, you want to give your mates yeah. a game to play, and you know how frustrating it is sending a mate a game that's online and you need to get you need to buy a new passport with it. So this is gonna be even more annoying. Like, yeah. it says this game is registered on one console, one console only. You cannot play it. That's gonna be pathetic. You're gonna be like so frustrated about that, and I yeah. What if you want to switch over your games? Exactly. If you want to switch over your games, and I'm gonna be like. What about playing offline? Exactly. And it's gonna be so frustrating. I mean, all games. I can see all games having some sort of online feature, whether it's downloadable content or something like this. And most games do now. Oh, do have some downloadable features, and that's that. That's awesome. But Blu-ray, Blu-ray DVDs have online features. I mean, for God's sake, really. And it's getting beyond a point now where you might as well just have a flipping game console and DVD player in one, like the uh, like PS3. And you might as well just flipping just have yeah. everything online. And, the, and also, the saying that the new console isn't gonna have Blu-ray. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. That's complete bullshit. If they don't have Blu-ray, right? Yeah. Then a lot of the content they're gonna try and fit in the disc isn't gonna fit, and they're gonna have to split it into several discs. Like Battlefield uh, 3. Yeah. Because that had that had single player and co-op on one disc, and then it had multiplayer on the other disc because multiplayer was more high quality, so they had to fit it on. They had to put it onto another disc. Ha. <laughs> yeah. But with PS3 they have Blu-ray so they can fit a lot of stuff on the disc. Yeah. But I mean with like Battlefield games and with Xbox and stuff, they do not have Blu-ray. And by the way, people think do you know what on the PS3, right? Yeah. With the PS uh, and the Xbox. Xbox has similar features to the uh, PC. Yeah. The PS3 is nothing like a PC. Oh and no. The it's, reason for that it it's nothing is like because the formats for it are awful. The formats for it are too hard to go for. They're very hard to go for for game developers. That's why you always see crappy little ports of cards coming to that. That's why you always get the buggy ports of it. Yeah. You know. I mean, uh, you know, I, I am. Be I, I made my choice well, and I'm very, very happy that I'm bought a thingy. What do you call it? Um, Xbox. <laughs> I'm trying to think of the name, man. I am very, very happy that I made that choice because it, it's benefited me a lot. If I didn't have an Xbox right now, I wouldn't be able to make HD videos, would I? I would have to use component, which I suppose still is sort of HD, but it's not great HD, is it? So, you know, and that would have been devastating. Yeah. It's still bad. Yeah, the, the Xbox, it has... It has HD, right? Mm -hmm. But not true 1080p. Not got completely true 1080p. Got 1080p. That's that's for sure. But it's not got PC graphics. No, PC graphics are out of this world. The graphics on PC are much better than the actual monster one, and that runs in true 1080p quality. Yeah. So. That, that's where you, you go with it. Yeah, I mean, that's definitely yeah. true. I mean, what Ross just said there is completely true. The graphics on PC are literally out of this world. Ross, have you bought a bow knife, oh boy? Oh, shit, no. I'm gonna go get one in a minute. Yeah. Don't knife him! Oh, sorry. Let me knife him. <laughs> but, but yeah, um, it, Ross is completely not really true about that. The the graphics are fab on PC. I mean, me and Ross have played some, uh, some serious hardcore, uh, well, Ross, quick, come over here and come and get it. We'll wait for yeah. us to go. Uh, get it, get it, get it. Right, and um, you know, they really are fab. And um, they definitely will uh, benefit people in the future if they're going, if it's switching to, uh, to PC. Because a lot of people think that it's easier to swap to PC than keep on buying a new console every so many years. Uh, which is, um, it's a true fact at the end of the day, because all you got to do is update uh, some of your hardware. That doesn't cost that much. Yeah. Yeah, well, it does cost a lot of money. But it depends. With the PC, you can have a, uh, a, a, a you can have a good couple of years of some of the graphics. Uh, in some extent, it's actually easier to buy the Xbox than the PC 
mm. because the graphics cards cost a lot of money and a lot of the games need good graphics to run it and you might need to update to get nice and better kind of FPS and stuff yeah for games but let's see where you're coming from because Xbox is a it, it's got less benefits than PC yeah and the whole PC gaming is is the shit yeah and we're not PC elitist by the way I'm no one near PC elitist no, I mean what I don't, do? I don't hardcore PC game. I've got, I've got a few regular games on there that I enjoy, but I can't. I'm, I'm not a hardcore PC gamer. Definitely not. See, yeah, we're not PC elitists. We just stick by the facts. Yeah. So basically, we can't really, we can't really tell you all about PCs, but you know, we do know some, some definitely basic facts about the whole. The whole sort of thing. PC world. Yeah. I mean, guys, I love PC. I'm hoping to be some sort of software programmer or technician when I get older, and I, you know, I'm halfway there already, so I do hope to be that. And did we get a perk? Oh, I'll yay! Get... Got a who's What'd who? Get... Oh, no, I don't know that perk. Anyway, well, with the, like we said, with the whole PC, the PC Xbox deal, the PC Elite thing. It's really up to your preference, isn't it? If you want a, if you want something that will be able to run good graphics, uh, be able to run your programs and stuff, and you want something that's just gonna benefit you with rendering videos and stuff, you just get the PC. If you want to just hardcore game and just, like record from your Xbox or something, you get the uh, the Xbox. Yeah. Because in the end, I think the cheaper of the two is gonna be the. Uh, um, it's gonna be the. Uh, oh, well, it really depends. Um, I think there may be the Xbox, which is gonna be the cheaper. Yeah, I I, I can see but that. I may be wrong. Because. But then again, you can buy like a six hundred dollar or six hundred pound PC, and you can like download free to play games, can't you? Yeah. I mean, I can yeah. definitely see the Xbox being cheaper, just because. That's my personal opinion. It's probably not going to happen, yeah. but you know, it's it's my personal opinion. Yeah, in but the seriously, when I get the money to, I would get myself a new PC. Mm. I mean, at the moment, if you, I mean, you got a pretty decent PC going. Um, um it's so, not, some people would beg to differ. It's good for gaming. Some people have worse PCs. But I wouldn't say it's the best PC going. Oh shit! Anyway, so wait. Yeah. You uh, you got your partnership? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I'm over the moon with that. And we just need to say something else. When Hayden said that he he was doing it non-profit. I don't know if he meant that. I think he meant that at the moment he was doing it non-profit. Yeah. The reason for that was because he didn't have any payment options, and that he isn't profiting at all from it at the moment. Soon yeah. he will be, but not at the moment. But he won't profit from it for a very long time. I'll just say that. Like I said, guys. But when he does start pro, yeah. When he does start profiting, let me show you guys. Like, like I said, guys. You know, the money will go straight to uh, the YouTube channel and get in stuff for it um, you know and yeah. and actually and the actual ordered a caps card today y'all ordered one today well he's he's ordering it apparently he's gonna order a Roxio HD game capture why a Roxio HD um mainly because of the, of the cheaper options but I reckon it'd be quite good do you wait what if he ends up accidentally getting Rocks you. Nah, he won't. He will get. I'm, I'm just w wondering. He is all. He's only on for Amazon. Okay. So, I mean, if you, I mean, if there's any problems with your thing, you just send it straight back to Amazon. Where the, the, the thing yeah. you have the thing is, what if he orders the wrong product? He won't. I'll, I'll, I'll be there when he orders it. Alright, that's, oh, right, that's good then. Oh god, I'm dying. 
Loving a monkey. Alright, good, good, good. I'm gonna get the box. Alright, I'm coming to come get the box as well. I need a better bloody weapon than this piece of crap. I've got the uh, uh, meal kick. And yeah, I've still got a here too. Um, anyway, Ross, what about this thing uh, about a uh, sub Saturday or something like that? Do you want to still do that? Uh, true. As in, like, basically, we get a load of people. Well, n not a load of people, you know, we get, we, 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 we get, we get a few people and we, uh, we invite them to, like, the subs and, uh, see if they want to, like, sub to us or, or, or be in our live stream or just, just, just definitely get some subs in our live stream. I like it could be well, good. You wanna, um, on your channel, you wanna play with subscribers, do you? Yeah, sort of, I reckon that'd be a good, uh, Well, if you wanna play with subscribers, oh God. that would be cool. You'd know that I can't play with subscribers on my channel because I've got a capture card to do it with. Yeah. But if we did it on your channel, that would be that'd be nice. They would enjoy that. Yeah. I mean, you've got a lot less subscribers than mine, and you've got a lot less dedicated ones, not to be an idiot or anything. Yeah. But, I mean, it could work. Yeah. Honestly, I think that we could do something. Because my subscribers will quickly turn into your subscribers. Fast. Yeah, I mean, I definitely want to get. Where have you gone? Um, I've actually uh, jumped down here. Oh, flip! Flip yeah. me in my 